So you just ordered a brand new Mark 8 Golf R, but when will you receive it? You know, that's the biggest thing. You're sort of waiting around, you know, you've paid a lot of money for this car, starting price at 39,000. It's a lot of money. It's sunny. You want to enjoy it while you still can, you know, <laughs> everything going on. You want to get some fun. You want to get some enjoyment out of something you've put a lot of money into. Well, today I'm going to go through a few well, I've had a lot of feedback from a lot of owners actually who've been ordering cars and I've been fortunate enough to drive a Mark 8 Golf R myself and it's great to hear the story. Now I'm going to straight away read a letter which VW have sent this Golf 8 R owner and discuss my thoughts around this letter directly from Volkswagen over in Milton Keynes, so kind of like their main HQ and a little bit in the UK. And yeah, let's go through this. I'll pop the letter on the screen and I'll read through with you now. So as I said before, this was sent directly to a Mark 8 Golf R customer and this was sent on the 16th of July from Milton Keynes. Potential production delays on your Volkswagen order. Dear customer, we are delighted you have chosen the Volkswagen model and together with your Volkswagen retailer aim to ins inspire you with an outstanding product. Unfortunately, you will have to ask, we will have to ask for your patience for the delivery of your new Volkswagen in all likelihood. We will not be able to meet our usual delivery times for orders that we provide to your Volkswagen retailer. Supply bottlenecks slow production. This delay is primarily due to bottlenecks in supply. The effects of the global COVID-19 pandemic have led to a significant impact on the production and supply chains for electronic components, such as semiconductors across all models. This is affecting the global automotive industry and Volkswagen is also suffering from these component supply restraints at present. The range of equipment affected extends from the modular infotainment systems to sunroofs, steering, transmission and tow bars. Your Volkswagen retailer will keep you up to date. Our current view is that this unsatisfactory situation should improve through the second half of 2021. Please be assured that Volkswagen is doing everything it can to keep delays as short as possible. Unfortunately, it is likely to be some time before your Volkswagen retail is able to confirm the final production and delivery date to you. We're providing frequent updates to your Volkswagen retail about the situation. We understand that the situation is unsatisfactory and disappointing for you, but to kindly ask your patience during these unprecedented times. And this was from Andrew Savas, director of Volkswagen. So this particular owner last had a provisional date of August to receive their car. It's now been pushed back to October. Now, what does this letter mean? Now, it's pretty obvious, you know, I've kind of read it in black and white. There are a lot of delays in the market and this is causing so many issues and so many problems. And on top of that, as the date that I'm recording this, which is Friday, the 23rd of July, we've seen sort of more horrific you know flooding across Europe and in Germany which for me I think is also going to affect um supply as well to a point because of the devastation it's you know it's it's very very awful times and you know I'm sorry to in some ways to talk about the automotive world when there's so much pain going on but you know this is an automotive channel hopefully it'll keep you informed and but obviously there are far bigger things to worry about so yes this is obviously the small part of the situation that we're all going through but being a car channel talking about the market go far a lot talking about talking to owners quite a lot the delays are not good now the thing is Volkswagen can send out these letters because obviously they don't want people to cancel their orders you know they don't want people to obviously complain and all this kind of stuff and fundamentally the manufacturer tends to win particularly when it comes to margins from a customer to what they're actually getting for a car cars depreciate um, brand new cars are worth obviously quite a lot of money people will be putting down deposits and these deposits are then being held by Volkswagen because obviously they you know the car is not being built yet they're not just going to refund that or anything like that whilst your car is still being ordered when I've ordered a new car in the past the only new car that I've ordered was my Fiesta ST it took about three months to get delivered three four months from when I ordered it um yeah so that that was about right for me and I think across the board, that's generally what it is. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. Now, what I've heard from a lot of people is it's getting pushed back and back and back for a lot of people. And you do wonder that the estimates are sort of just, it's almost impossible to judge now just from, from where we are. And the semiconductor thing is obviously quite a huge thing. It affects a lot of the um, sort of manufacturing market, even from like, you know, like the PlayStation 5s. No one can get hold of those semiconductor issue is also a problem with that as well you know you can't get these microchips in the in the brain of these products that we know and love you know you can't do anything now i spoke about this some months ago now i'll put a link up there and 
it's still having a huge effect today and you know we're sort of heading towards into august 2021 now should it put you off getting a new car like this well to be honest with you if you're committed to the car and if you you know if you watch my channel and you enjoy it and you like it and you just want to see it through certainly stick it out and you know once you get it you know you, you should be happy for sure you, you know it's a fantastic car there's no doubt and the flip side of it if you're having to wait till 2022 which trust me i'm sure some people are going to get pushed back to that kind of level um potentially if you're particularly if you're ordering it say today if things don't improve in the world situation that's something you're gonna to have to think of and that's a that's a big delay you know the the technology the world in the automotive industry is changing so fast with the tech um you know i've no vw have done a lot of work on sort of like the software you look at their id freeze and it's, it's the same across the golf platform as well and they've really improved all the issues that they've initially had because the technology and the understanding of it changes and they're able to get on top of things now, I, I just think the car world is changing so, so fast that come 2022, you know, who knows where we'll be, where we'll be at and where we'll be thinking. So, you know, there is a bit of a risk to sort of say, if you're waiting that long, is it really worth it? I'll have to let you make that call. But I wanted to share this little letter just to give you a lot an idea. Um, you know, I talk a lot about this channel, about the car market and how things are all up in the air and you know used cars are worth quite a lot no one can get hold of new cars and you know i have great discussions with you guys in the comments and you, you know your knowledgeable audience again please like share and subscribe if you want to be a part of this channel you know i really appreciate it and you know it's a great little community channel and i hope you enjoy it too i generally think that the people who are actually sitting in a car at the moment are probably the ones that are probably lucked out in some ways for sure and those waiting you know may have to wait a lot longer than they think and I, I'll, I'll keep a track with this owner as well to see um if they do get it in october you know if it gets delayed anymore new cars you know sometimes they can come with faults as well so it's so it's all that kind of up in the air kind of situation but i hope that just seeing sort of like a direct letter from volkswagen a recent letter um it's something that i imagine has gone out to all sort of vw or new car customers you know it's not just something specific for the mark 8 golf r and yeah something that i wanted to share which is potentially a little bit more <laughs> official i guess and um yeah it's it's strange how what's happening and stay tuned to this channel if you want to kind of know a little bit more about the car market if you're looking to buy a car sell a car if you like the golf 5 if you like the vw audi group products if you like porsche um it's certainly a channel worth sticking with and um, hopefully i can help you out along the journey and you can get more of an experience out of your potential purchase and by being part of this community that's kind of what it's all about but hope you enjoyed it hope you found it useful let me know your thoughts in the comments you know do, is this a bit of a kick in the teeth to you Are you watching would you kind of think you know what this isn't good enough i'm spending a lot of money you know i, I appreciate that it's uh, unprecedented circumstances but we live in an instant world don't we we live in a world of instagram we want things now we don't want things late and that is just the nature of where we're at in 2021 now you know it's just weird i, I find it very strange because of that the game changes so so quickly so delays are not what people want to hear but you know let me know your thoughts in the comments and um, i'll be really interested to know and if you have any experiences as well, I do read comments and get involved as well. So if you do have something which um, you'd like to share as well about potential your order, um, you know, I'm sure someone will find it useful in this video, checking through the comments as well and to hopefully help them out. And um, yeah, that's kind of what the channel's about. But listen, thank you so much for watching. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Good luck with your order. If you've got your Mark 8 Golf R on order. Again, thoughts as always welcome in the comments. Thanks for watching. Cheers, guys.